Where else but the Cartoon Network can you turn yourself into a monster, spend every afternoon with super adventurers, get the latest June gossip, <laughs> watch three hours straight of Daffy Duck, make Dino your pen pal, help dastardly find his stolen car and win your own car just for helping, meet a new world premiere tune every single week, see your cat debut on TV, catch the latest in Japanimation, get your very own fizz, and that's just what I could fit into this spot. It's no secret, Bob. The Cartoon Network's the best place for cartoons. The Cartoon Network gives you tunes day and night, but you still want more. Give me more! All right, you cartoon hogs. How about a three-hour super chunk of one great tune star every Sunday? It's Super Chunk. Sundays at 4, only on the Cartoon Network. We've got a three-hour super chunk of the wildest, craziest, laziest dog of them all. A pup named Scooby-Doo. Sunday at 4 on the only network for Scooby lovers. Cartoon Network. No matter where you go on Sunday, be here on Sunday night when the Cartoon Network brings you world premiere tunes, Mr. Spin's Cartoon Theater, and the Moxie Show. New tunes, great movies, and Moxie. It's the best Sunday night on television. Premiering Sunday on the Cartoon Network. Be here. Get ready for the grand opening of the most amazing theater in the world, Mr. Spim's Cartoon Theater. Sunday, right after the debut of the brand new world premiere tune, Mr. Spim will be opening his doors for the very first time to show you the Cartoon Network premiere of Race for Your Life, Charlie Brown. It's one of the all-time great two movies starring everyone's favorite bald kid, Charlie Brown, and Snoopy, of course. So be there opening night at Mr. Spim's Cartoon Theater, Sunday at 7 p.m. on the greatest place for cartoons, the Cartoon Network. Where else but the Cartoon Network can you turn yourself into a monster, save me from utter destruction, see the many faces of Ranger Smith, spend every afternoon with super adventurers, get the latest tune gossip, <laughs> watch three hours straight of Daffy Duck, make Dino your pen pal, help dastardly find his stolen car and win your own car just for helping. Oh, secret, take those wheels. Meet a new world premiere tune every single week, see your cat debut on TV. Spend every lunch with a talk in a hand named Haas. Don't forget those secret decoder pins you can win. Catch the latest in Japan animation. Get your very own fez, like mine. And that's just what I could fit into this 60-second spot. Cartoon lovers, this is your chance to make all your tune fantasies come true. Here at the Cartoon Network, we're not just playing tunes. We're giving you great prizes, making you wear strange hats, and having you listen to a squirrel with a lisp. You tell him, secret. It's no secret, Bob. The Cartoon Network's the best place for cartoons. Do you think skin is in? Yeah! Do you drive with your feet? Yeah! Do you like the sound of heavy rock? Yeah! Then you're a Fredhead. Your appetite for modern Stone Age good times is bigger than a side of Bronto Wick. So grab your water buffalo hat and join Fred, Barney, and a dinosaur that thinks he's a dog for the Flintstones. Tonight at 8 on the Cartoon Network, where the stones rock. <laughs> World Premiere Tunes just might be the biggest news in the history of cartoons. So big that the Cartoon Network wants to give you this big, big, big TV to watch them on. Here's how you win one. Check out the new World Premiere Tunes Sunday night at 7. Then right after the tune, we're going to ask you a question about the World Premiere Tune you just saw. Example. What was the name of the Powerpuff Girls teacher? Oprah? That is incorrect. So you better be paying attention. Or no big. TV for you. We got four of these big Panasonic TVs to give away, so we're doing this little quiz for the next four Sunday nights. You want to win? You got to watch the tune, then look for the question and address to send your answer to. If we pick your name, not only do you win the big, big, big Panasonic TV, but you'll also get this posh theater chair to watch it in. So keep your eyes peeled every Sunday night at 7 Woo! for World Premiere Tunes. Big new tunes and a big new TV. Another big new reason to be watching World Premiere Tunes on the Cartoon Network. The best place for big, big tunes. <laughs> Tonight on Toon Heads, all these tunes want is a little shut-eye. Is that too much to ask? It's Insomnia Week on Toon Heads. Tonight at midnight, only on the Cartoon Network.
No matter where you go on Sunday, be here on Sunday night when the Cartoon Network brings you world premiere tunes with a brand new cartoon and new toon stars that you can only see here. Then the curtain goes up on Mr. Spim's Cartoon Theater, a weird place where Mr. Spim shows you a great toon movie. Finally, it's the Moxie Show, starring the Cartoon Network's very own Moxie and Flea with all new episodes, new tunes, great movies, and Moxie. It's the best Sunday night on television, premiering Sunday on the Cartoon Network. Be here! Are you ready for the next world premiere tune? Have you marked off your calendar for Sunday night? Have you set your VCR and told everyone that a brand new star is about to be born? The curtain goes up on Dexter's Laboratory, Sunday night at 7 on the Cartoon Network. Yeah? Hey, hey, hey. Turn on the Cartoon Network. G-Force is on. Okay, Elroy, my boy. Thanks for the tip. Hello, Betty. Hi, Top Cat. Turn on the Cartoon Network, little lady. You're missing Bugs and Zappy. Oh, great. I'll get Wilma. Hello there, Race. What are you doing? Wrestling alligators. How about you? Watching the Centurions on Cartoon Network. You gotta turn it on. I know, I know. The Cartoon Network is the best darn place for cartoons. Only on the Cartoon Network. It's the G-Force. It's out of this world. It's action-packed. And it's here on the Cartoon Network. It's G-Force, Saturday at 4.30. And you'll only find it on the Cartoon Network. The Cartoon Network is the best darn place for cartoons in the whole world! Call your cable operator and tell him to tune you in! <laughs> Greetings, Earthlings. I am Zorak. Watch Godzilla at 5, SWAT Cats at 5.30, The Jetsons at 6, and Dinobot at 6.30. Only on the Cartoon Network. Right here at the Cartoon Network, a young prince may find the treasure that could save his people. Unless this evil pirate reaches it first. The Pirates of Dark Water, Sunday morning at 11 on the Cartoon Network. Look deep into the crystal ball and you will see the future. At exactly nine tonight, you will experience this. It's the new world premiere tune on the Cartoon Network. Your future looks very bright. West. 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 Johnny Quest. Tonight at 6.30 on the Cartoon Network. World Premiere Tunes just might be the biggest news in the history of cartoons. So big that the Cartoon Network wants to give you this big, big, big TV to watch them on. Here's how you win one. Check out the new World Premiere Tunes Sunday night at 7. Then right after the tune, we're going to ask you a question about the World Premiere Tune you just saw. Example. What was the name of the Powerpuff Girls teacher? Oprah? That is incorrect. So you better be paying attention. Or no big, big. TV for you. We got three of these big Panasonic TVs left, and one just might have your name on it. You want to win? You got to watch the tune, then look for the question and address to send your answer to. If we pick your name, not only do you win the big, big, big Panasonic TV, but you'll also get this posh theater chair to watch it in. So keep your eyes peeled every Sunday night at 7 Woo! for World Premiere Tunes. Big new tunes and a big new TV. Another big new reason to be watching World Premiere Tunes on the Cartoon Network. The best place for big, big tunes. It's time for two stupid pet tips from the Cartoon Network's newest stars, Two Stupid Dogs. One, never let your dog eat a can of Cut the Cheese canned cheese product. Two, watch Two Stupid Dogs Saturday at 7 and 11 on the world's only Cartoon Network.
tonight at 6.30 on the Cartoon Network. Eureka! It's a major tune discovery coming to the Cartoon Network this Sunday. It's time for As the World Tunes, tales of love and romance as only the Cartoon Network can tell them. Race Bannon, adventurer, father figure, and all-around good sport. His life was a tapestry with one thread missing, till she walked in from the past, the distant past. With her homespun warmth and primitive charm, this barefoot Contessa knew how to light a man's fire. But there was a problem. Barney, no, this Barney, a jealous husband with no neck and eyes that refused to dilate. Race topped his rival on all counts, charm, physique, and table manners. In the end, none of this mattered, for though her passion for race was strong, Betty's loyalty was with her husband. And so, it was to a half pint in a loincloth that Race Bannon lost his one true love. A romance like that could only happen here on the Cartoon Network.